San Diego is a Southern California dream, with 70 degree temperatures, nearly year round, and very little rain. A visit to San Diego should be on everyone's bucket list. It can be tough to choose which of the many magnificent attractions in the San Diego area you should visit. This travel guide will help you find what we believe are the best places to visit in the area. If you think we left anything out, let us know in the comments below. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Number 10. San Diego Art Institute The San Diego Art Institute's campus in the center of downtown San Diego is a stunning historic structure established in 1912. The building itself is incredible and has been converted into an art gallery that showcases the work of local and international artists. The museum also holds one of Southern California's greatest collections of modern art, with over 6,000 pieces by over 1,000 artists. The museum has two main galleries, the Main Gallery and the Library Gallery. The Main Gallery focuses on showcasing artwork produced by local artists, while the Library Gallery showcases works by international artists who have lived or studied in San Diego. Both galleries are open daily from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. Number 9. La Jolla Sea Caves the La Jolla Sea Caves are a must-see for San Diego, California tourists. La Jolla is a breathtaking location. The caves are located along the coast of La Jolla in the Pacific Ocean and have been used by humans for over 10,000 years. They were formed as part of the San Diego Trough Fault System and are home to several types of marine life, including starfish, sea anemones, fish, and crabs. You may even see sea lions in the area. The site was first discovered in 1929 by a local fisherman, who noticed large waves crashing against a reef near his house. He then contacted the United States Navy and sent out divers later that year to map out how deep the water was and what type of creatures lived there. This was done to protect sailors from accidentally crashing into the rocks within the area. Today, it's hard not to find yourself intrigued by these beautiful formations. Number 8. Potato Chip Rock Next, we have Potato Chip Rock, located on the summit of Mount Woodson. The rock is made of sandstone and is famous for resembling a potato chip. The trail is lined by trees and other plants that provide shade from the hot sun, making it a perfect place for families with children to visit on a hot day. Sandcrawler Rock is located on the same trail, named for its resemblance of a transport vehicle in the Star Wars universe. Number 7. Balboa Park it is the largest public park in the United States and features gardens, green spaces, cultural attractions, and many museums, which include the San Diego Museum of Man, which houses an extensive collection of Native American artifacts, the San Diego Air and Space Museum, the San Diego Natural History Museum, and the San Diego Zoo. The park also features botanical garden playgrounds and family picnic areas. The Spanish architecture within the park is truly beautiful. Balboa Park is worth visiting if you're looking for a place to relax with your kids or just want to hide out from the hustle and bustle of a big city. Number 6. Pacific Beach Pacific Beach, or PB as the locals call it, has an endless beach party vibe. The beach is best known for its beach party atmosphere that never ends. It may not be for everyone, but if you are looking for some good times, this is the place to visit. With three miles of ocean, front boardwalk to enjoy by bike or foot, this is the relaxed area of the city, well-liked by sunbathers and surfers. Hotel bars, beachfront bars, restaurants, shops and cafes line the boardwalk. Mission Boulevard is full of casual bars that draw a young crowd to the area. Crystal Pier is a great fishing spot. It also offers over-the-water cottages for rent. It is a great spot to watch the sunset over the Pacific Ocean. Number 5. Sunset Cliffs Natural Park Sunset Cliffs Natural Park is home to many animals, including birds, rabbits, squirrels, mice, and deer. The park also offers hiking, and the trail is approximately 5 miles long, taking 3 to 4 hours to complete. The trail starts at the San Eligio Lagoon and goes through many different areas of the park, including Red Rock Canyon and Torrey Pines Glens. Thus, it's the best choice if you want to see beautiful views and dramatic cliffs. Number 4. Mission Bay Bike Path Mission Bay is a perfect place to spend the day. The 12-mile bike path offers a scenic, relaxing ride that is perfect for tourists and locals alike. It winds through and around the bay and past miles of beaches, giving you plenty of opportunities to explore the area on bike or foot. You can also take advantage of Mission Bay's amazing food truck scene, which is always bustling and full of delicious options. Number 3. USS Midway Museum the USS Midway Museum is a naval aircraft carrier museum located on San Diego Bay, which gives it an incredible view of the city and its surroundings. 
A great way to spend an afternoon is checking out this iconic ship. The museum is contained within the USS Midway itself, an aircraft carrier that served the United States Navy. The museum features an exhibit that tells its story from beginning to end, including artifacts from all eras of this ship's life. There are even interactive exhibits where kids can play iPad games and learn about the ship's history. Go up the flight deck to see many examples of military aircraft on display. One of the most popular parts of any visit to the USS Midway Museum is going on a boat tour around the bay. Guests can choose between two different tours, one that takes passengers around downtown San Diego and another that takes them out into open water, where they can see whales swimming by. Number 2. San Diego Zoo San Diego Zoo, a world-famous, world-class zoo. This 1,800-acre wildlife sanctuary and the botanical park are home to 3,600 creatures from more than 300 species, providing visitors with a lot to see and do. The park has many exhibits that include lions, tigers, giraffes, koala bears, and zebras, as well as monkeys and other primates. These animals can be seen roaming free on their own or in groups of two or three. Visitors can also meet up close with these animals at the safari train, where they can feed them apples or carrots from their hands while they ride through the zoo grounds. Take a ride on the Skyfiery aerial tram for amazing views of the zoo and Balboa Park. Visitors can also participate in some educational activities, like animal habitats or conservation programs at the zoo's educational center, which has over 200 classrooms for school groups to attend classes focusing on animal behavior and conservation efforts worldwide. Number 1. Coronado Island Coronado Island may well be the most beautiful location in the San Diego area. There are five white sand beaches on the island, Coronado Central Beach, Coronado Dog Beach, Silver Strand State Beach, Glorietta Bay Beach, and the Ferry Landing Marketplace. The island is home to specialty shops, art galleries, and restaurants. Coronado Beach offers amazing sunsets, calm waters, and soft white sands. It is breathtaking. The Hotel del Coronado, a Southern California icon, overlooks Coronado Beach. The hotel debuted in 1888, an architectural masterpiece. The Dell was a destination resort before the term existed, attracting wealthy patrons from all over the country and Europe. These guests generally stayed for months at a time. At the time of construction, it was one of the largest buildings with electric lighting. Today, it is still internationally known as one of the best beachside resorts in the world. The beachfront cabanas feature beachfront terraces and an in-ground swimming pool great for kids and adults alike. Coronado Island is a must-see when in San Diego earning it the number one spot in our travel guide. This brings us to the end of this video. If you like the video, please consider subscribing and sharing so we can keep bringing more content like this. Also, let us know your thoughts in the comments below. See you next time.